Okay, the giant. Great. So, um, let's talk about our leg positions, especially during the kicks. Well, if you are not that uh, advanced dancer yet and you are competing like in bronze or silver, you go through those like basic um, steps, it's, it's still important for you to know that every time when our leg are lifting the floor um, not every time but especially if we're gonna talk today about the kicks during the kicks especially for girls especially for ladies it's important to remember sometimes maybe practice in the pencil skirt imagine that you have a super tight skirt and it's not allowed you to do that know that know this position during the chasse know that that's not attractive um, I try my best to show it <laughs> so um, you always have to feel the engagement in your inner thigh muscles so it's kind of always uh, pretty tight and compact now during the um, kicks uh, the way we lift our, our leg up it's not that that's a little bit too simple, too easy to do, and it's not pretty. So we always have to remain the um, connection, first of all, with the floor. So we have to slide the foot in first, before we're going to lift it up. Now, when you're going to lift your leg up, I want you to feel connection between your right ankle, let's say I'm right now I'm going to lift my right leg, between your right ankle and your standing leg. So you have to keep pushing your both legs to the kind of like center so it's always connected action and do not forget to point your toes because these positions are not really pretty yeah so you're kind of, when you lift your leg up you already start to point your toes and lifting your leg up by kind of point curve your toes a little bit more in for a prettier line. So we're gonna do a simple exercise just to train the, uh, the legs um, and prepare ourselves for a nice and pretty kicks. So we're gonna slide our right leg in and now in connection, strong connection to the standing leg up and release it down. Our one, two, three, four, keep the connection, five, let's try other leg, slide with the floor, one, two, three, four, five, great, now a little bit more um, advanced way of doing that action, we're going to lift our right leg up, at the same time when we're gonna bring our left heel up so we're kind of going to the high passe release it down up and step again left leg go to the passe down up and side step again up down up on your standing leg and step one Two, so we kind of have a double action. A one, a two, and step. A one, a two, and step. And again, a one, a two, step. One, two, step. It's very um, important to use your standing leg entire time during the kicks. 
but in general as well. So when we're going to do a kicks, the second part what you also have to can practice as an exercise action, um, we kind of continue to do the same movement. But right now we can uh, activate not only our ankle, but our knee as well. So when we slide our leg up, go up on your standing leg, bring your a heel away from the floor, but keep your legs straight. So legs straight. Now when you lower your heel down, flex your knee. Again, straight your leg and sidestep. Again, go up, flex your knee, up, straight leg and side again up flex your standing knee go down up and side again up flex your standing knee and lower yourself up and side that's basically your kick uh, kicks action in the jive so our combination will include today kick kicks action forward um, Kickball changes, um, and that's all. That's all. That's it. So we will start with the right leg, and we're gonna do uh, for eight counts. So four kicks in total. Yes, for each leg. So we'll have a one, a two, a three, a four, a five, a six, seven, a eight. And just pay attention to my leg positions. I'm not trying to take a huge step to the side. Well, you can have a side step, but after you just have to make sure that your legs uh, will connect before you're gonna do the kick. And number two important point, if right now you see me facing yes to you. When I'm doing the kicks forward, that's not exactly forward. So we're not kicking forward. Try to uh, use and um, use more angles in, in your movement. And when we kick forward, for, we're kicking forward diagonal towards the corner of the room. And then we collect and you can close your feet. And again, we already directing our knee towards the corner of the room. Then we can create the kick action and return. So our knees, are always kind of under the angle. Let's look much nicer and prettier on the floor. So we have four kicks in total. And uh, one, uh, two, three, uh, four. Keep connection between your legs, seven, uh, eight. Now we have one, two. So we have a slow slide. One, two, uh, three, four down in cross. And again, slow slide, five, six, uh, seven, eight. So basically, when we have a slow passe, I give you a chance and opportunity to really feel this slide action. Yes, for two counts. One, two. Now, we have to jump through our right leg to the left into the cross position. And again, connect your inner thigh muscles. And again, slow passe, one, two and jump three, four into the cross. So uh, collect your inner thigh muscles right away. Let's try it. One, two, a three, four, five, six, a seven, eight. Mm -hmm. And then we can continue it with regular kick ball change. And again, when you have a regular kick ball change, try to activate the gap in connection to towards your standing leg. A uh, one, a uh, two, a uh, three. A four, a five, a six, seven, a eight. Remember, we're not playing soccer, so we don't need to kick our leg forward or kick towards our partner or our competitor. Well, it's not a smart move. <laughs> um, we have to always point our toes while we're kicking forward towards the floor. So if you notice, my leg is, is my point goes down and then I switch, down and switch, uh, down, switch, down, switch. Kick ball change usually is not a progressive movement. Unless you need to really travel, travel with the switch, travel with the second step, not with the kick, yeah? Okay, 
let's review everything. So we have three figures in total, um, starting with the kicks. Uh, one, uh, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, passe. One, two, uh, three, four, five, six, uh, seven, eight, and kick ball change. You can make it in place. One, uh, two, three, uh, four, five, uh, six, seven, uh, eight. Great. And then we can start over again. Let's try with me and practice. With, uh, we're starting with the right leg. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, a uh, three, four, five, six, a uh, seven, eight. One, a uh, two, three, a uh, four, five, a uh, six, seven, a uh, eight. Perfect. Great job, guys. Dance Today continues to create entertaining and educational content because of the contributions from viewers like you. If you would like to donate to the channel, please click on the Patreon link in the description below. Thank you for your support.